All right, good morning, everybody. Charlie back with you. And uh, today, yeah, notice there's no Tiger gear on. That's because the Tigers beat the Kansas City Royals last night to win the AL Central and eliminate Chicago from playoff contention. So, fuck you, Chicago. Now, with that said and done, I say let's get on with some pepper tasting. So there's no Tiger gear today because, you know, we spoke on the field last night and doing on. So what we do have is the Tiger Teeth Chili. Let's we'll give you a little tour of the plant. Here you go, give it a nice spin. Nice peppers everywhere. So, with that being said, let's get on with some pepper eating. So I'm gonna bring the plant right up here, right alongside me. Pick me a pepper. When I say Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle, pickled peppers, I'm gonna pick me a tiger teeth, and I guess I'll take this one right here. Blows it off. Nice red pepper. Um. I don't know, maybe inch and a half, two inches long, maybe two inches. Um, anyways, um, yeah, I'm not going to mess around. I'm going to get into this because I got stuff to do. Really no smell. Cut the stem off. Really no heat smell to it. So, um, here we go. Three, two, one. Sorry, the Tiger Teeth for my AO Central Champ Detroit Tigers. Here we go. And three, two, one, go. Thirty seconds in, and this pepper I can tell you tastes exactly like the Bujalokio. Almost identical, probably without the without the heat level, but the same flavor. Almost identically. It almost had a sweet smell to it. Nice sweet smell. I was overly surprised on uh, the heat it had at first, but not scorching hot. But I tell you, it has the exact same flavor as a Bujalokio. Nothing to go wow about, nothing to, I don't know. Got the super hot flavor, but I don't have the super hot heat. Burn concentrated on the tongue. I don't know, I think maybe that the Fatali people out there might actually uh, be into this. I don't even know if you can see this plant being, you know, I use my phone so I can get you YouTube videos in high definition. But I'm sure if you can see me, you can see the plant as soon as I rotate it. 
As you can see, I got a few pods left on it. It's starting to get cold here. I'll probably be doing some overwintering this uh, weekend. I'm going to bring in a couple of my plants and try to save them. So they'll be two year next year. Yeah, I'm at three minutes and there's no burning. I mean, nothing more than some hot sauce, but... I guess I probably should have turned the TV down. But nothing, nothing to report about. Just like I said, it has the flavor of a blue jalokia. It just is not hot. So anybody out there looking for that heat, or the flavor, I'm sorry, the, the flavor of the Bujalokia and, and not quite as hot, you could probably deal with this. I really wasn't going to eat a pepper today, but, you know, being my Tigers won last night, won the division and are going to the playoffs, that is. As you can see, I got the... Jeremiah Johnson going. That'll be for hunting season. So, just wait this out. Nothing spectacular. Yeah, not an awesome flavor, but you know, it was kind of deceiving because it did smell kind of sweet. So. Yeah, we're at the five minute mark. Actually, five <laughs> five minutes, but nothing to report. Like I said, if you want the flavor but not the heat of the boot, here it is. So, never know. Somebody may get this plant in the mail. All right, so. My timer phone is dying out, but as you're watching, you know I'm well over five minutes, probably like 5.40 right now. So, until next time, um, actually until next pepper, it's Charlie, the Tiger Teeth, thanks for tuning in.